Lord, as you have come, O oh God, to pray, may your power of the Holy Ghost take control, take preeminence, come down and glorify our name, Jesus. Holy Spirit of God, you are a God that consumed by fire. As we pray, O oh God, today, let whatever that has been in the foundation of our families be consumed by fire today in Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today we will, we will be praying, the, uh, the prayer term today is breaking family altars and all family evil covenants. Mm -hmm. That is what we will be praying today. So before we start, let us establish with Two scriptures. Let's see the book of Exodus 34, chapter 12 to 14. Exodus 34, 12 to 14. And Jeremiah 1, verse 10. So I want to read Exodus 34. 12 to 14. So let's take our Bible as we. Exodus 34. I read 12 from 12. Take heed to thyself, lest thou make a covenant with the inhabitants of the land, whither thou goest, lest it be for a snake in the midst of thee. God speaking through Moses, telling the people of Israel, be careful to where you are living, to where you are going. He's talking to us today that we should be very careful, that we should not make a covenant with the inhabitants, with the people where we are living, where we are going, that are not of God. Verse 13. But ye shall destroy their altars, break their images, and cut down their globes. God is telling us today that every altar, every image that people serve, Either from our father's house, from our mother's house, from our villages, should be destroyed today by the power in the name of Jesus. Amen. Verse 14. For thou shalt worship no other God, for the Lord, whose name is Jealous, is a jealous God. Thou shalt not worship any other God. 
This is the problem we have been fighting for. Our ancestors have served so many images, so many gods that are not Almighty God. And God is telling us, Thou shalt not serve other gods. There are so many, whatever you have taken so important more than God has become your God. So let's see the book of Jeremiah. Jeremiah 1. Verse 10. He says, See, I have this day set thee over the nations and over the kingdoms to root out and to pull down and to destroy and to throw down, to build and to plant. He's telling us that that power, that anointing, that grace, that authority in the name of Jesus, in the blood of Jesus, has been given unto us as children of God. That today, being this day, it has set us over, it has given us this dominion over nations, over kingdoms. To do what? To destroy, to root out, to pull down every stronghold in our families, in our life. To destroy whatever God has not planted in our foundations. The power of authority has been given us. He said, This sign shall follow them, they shall cast out demons. He said, When they lay hand on the sick, they shall recover. He said that we march upon scorpions. Even when we eat deadly things, poison, it will not harm us. These are the powers and promises of God, and it's real. If you believe it as a child of God. So now we have established with these two verses. So now we are going to pray. We are going to break every altar and every evil covenant in our lineage, in our generation, in our family. God of Elijah, send the fire. God of Elijah, send the fire. God of Elijah. I just want to describe what is evil utter. Sometimes we talk evil utter, evil utter. What is really this evil utter? Evil utter is a place where the wicked consult their gods. I come again. Evil utter is a place where the wicked is consult their gods. It is where destinies are summoned and programmed to fail. And to suffer untimely death, sickness, poverty, unfruitfulness, disappointment, stagnation, limitation, and sorrow. It is, uh, it is where destiny is not Evil altar is a place where wicked, the wicked, consult their gods. It is where destinies are summoned
whether you like it or not, they force it, they summon it spiritually and program it to fail. Not only to fail, but to suffer untimely death, sickness, poverty, disappointment, unfruitfulness, delay, stagnation, sorrow. There's still joy that is evil altar. Because we are praying for two things today, evil altar and evil covenant. So covenant is an agreement and working cooperation between two or more parties that is binding by an oath and there are penalties for breaking covenant. I come again. Covenant is an agreement and a working cooperation between two or more parties or people that is binding, committed by an oath And there are penalties, there are prices to pay for breaking such covenants. So this is a covenant. So when you put evil covenant, it becomes an agreement and working cooperation between two or more people that is binding by oath and there are consequences when such agreement or covenant are breaking. And the worst part of this covenant, evil covenant, is for generation to generation. To unborn children. When we were not born, our ancestors, many of them had made agreement with demons. Gods that we don't know. And when they are entering into this agreement, they enter the agreement for their generation. That means that their generation will continue to serve such gods. And when the generation comes, because they, they are unborn, they don't know about it. Their ancestors have died. And this demon in the family continue fighting. And unknown to us. So as a child of God, all you do is to fight it. You must fight it. You must fight it. So now we have established what evil, uh, evil order is and what covenant is. I will be raising prayer points. But when I raise it, now you have known the meaning of these two things. You pray it in your way, in your own way, or whatever you know is affecting you. So we want to start now. The first prayer point we are going to take. I will repeat it two times. Or you go after me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let every satanic altar. Let every satanic altar. That have been introduced. Have been introduced into, my family, into my family. Receive the fire of God. Receive the fire of God. Let every satanic altar. Let every satanic altar. That have been introduced into my family. That have been introduced into my family. By my forefathers. By my ancestors, from my father's house, from my mother's house, receive fire of Holy Ghost. Make it a prayer, begin to pray. My father and my God, Jehovah, let's share to this. Every satanic altar that has been introduced into my family, every evil altar has been introduced into my father's house, into my mother's house. Into my village, wherever they have been introduced in it, receive fire of the Holy Ghost, receive fire of the Holy Ghost, receive fire of the Holy Ghost, receive fire of the Holy Ghost. 
every evil water, wherever they are, every satanic water, today be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed by the power in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are going to pray. Every evil altar that someone has programmed me to fail. Every evil altar that someone has programmed me to fail. Every evil altar that someone me and program my marriage to fail. Every evil altar that someone me and program my marriage to fail. Today receive the fire of the Holy Ghost. Today receive the fire of the Holy Ghost. Today receive the thunder of the Holy Ghost. Make it a prayer, and begin to pray. My Father and my God, every evil author that has someone and programmed me to fail, or to program my marriage to fail, or my plans to fail, today I stand against you. Today receive that fire, receive that fire, receive that fire. Receive that fire. Receive that fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray. We are going to pray. Every evil altar that the wicked are consulting their gods concerning my downfall. Every evil altar that the wicked are consulting their gods concerning my downfall. Every evil altar that the wicked are consulting their gods to disgrace me. Every evil altar that the wicked are consulting their gods to disgrace me. Today receive the fire of the Holy Ghost. Today receive the fire of the Holy Ghost. Be destroyed by the power in the name of Jesus. Be destroyed by the power of the Holy Ghost. Make it a prayer. Have mercy. Fire of my Lord, my Lord. Every evil order that consult me to fail to be shamed. My Father and my God, Jehovah and Shepherd. Be destroyed by the fire in the name of Jesus. Be destroyed today by the power in the name of Jesus. Oh, that brought me to faith. Receive fire, receive fire, receive fire, receive fire, receive fire, receive fire, receive fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let the sword of, of fire. Let the sword of fire begin to cut off. Begin to cut off. Every evil parental attachment. Every evil parental attachment. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let the sword of fire. Let the sword of fire begin to cut off. Begin to cut off. Every evil parental attachment. Every evil attachment. Now I just want to explain this evil parental attachment because of where you were born, because of your parents. Maybe your parents were not born again, and there is powers that follow them. As you were born, you also inherit it. We are going to pray. Every every evil parental attachment. Every evil parental attachment. Every pronouncement, negative pronouncement from my parents. Every negative pronouncement from my parents that affect my destiny. That affect my destiny. Today be cut off. Today be cut off by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Make it a prayer, begin to pray, my Father and my God. Let the sword of fire begin to cut every parental attachment. Every parental attachment. Every parental attachment. Every negative attachment. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. By the power in the name of Jesus. By the power in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. In Jesus. 
Jesus name we pray. Amen. I want to explain this place again. We are going to pray. Every evil parental attachment. There are some families. They were giving birth. Their parents have not married. And they follow the children. And you begin to see the children will be having children but without marriage. You will go into a family, you will see like four or three women, sisters, all have children. They may be living with men, but none of them married. They can have brothers living with women, having children, none of them are married. There are some, we are talking about parental attachment. There are some, once they go to husband's house, they have one issue. They live to another man. There are some people that have four children, five children, different men, different father. When you also watch it, watch their mother. Their mother, they have half brother or step brother or self sisters. Just watch it. These are parent, evil parental attachment. There are some, there is no peace in the marriage. Fight, 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 fight. Every day. When you check it, you can also find out that their parents are fighting. They inherit it into their own life. We are going to pray. Let the sword of fire begin to cut off. Amen. Every parental attachment Amen. by the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Amen. My Father, Amen. I my God. Over my shepherding. Kings of King. Kings of glory. Over my Lord and my God. We pray to the good God. Every sword of fire begin to cut off. Every parental attachment. 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 We destroy today. We destroy today. We destroy today. We destroy today. Every parental attachment. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. I still want to, in Jesus' name, I still want to explain this parental attachment. There are some. The parents are married, they divorce. The children are also married, the same divorce. So once they have two kids in the family, it's divorce. So my like that. Nothing to cause problem. When you trace it, you begin to see it has happened to the grandmother. It has happened to the mother. There is another parental attachment that once they marry, their husband does not last. It's a parental attachment. There are some once they marry, their wife does not last. There are some families. Every woman, their that is their wife died died before the husband. Immediately they marry them, the wife will begin to die. There is there's a parental attachment. We are going to pray. Every power, Every power. causing this problem, causing this problem. Wherever, they are, wherever they are, wherever they are coming from, today, today we arrest you by the blood of Jesus. We arrest you. We are next to you. Today is your end. Today is your end. Your power, your power is powerless. Your power is powerless. You take authority in the name of Jesus. I take authority in the name of Jesus. Today I am in charge. I am in charge. I cancel so called. I cancel so called. Make it a prayer, make it a prayer. My Father and my God, Jehovah, have a shame to me. Kings of the kings of God, Jehovah, my Lord and my God. I pray today, O God, every parental attachment, every parental attachment, today they are destroyed, today they are destroyed. 
This one take us to another prayer point. My father, my father, reveal to me, reveal to me any hidden covenant, any hidden covenant that the devil has arranged, that the devil has arranged against my life, against my life and my family. And my, family. My, father, my father, reveal to me, reveal to me any hidden covenant, any hidden covenant that the devil has arranged, that the devil has arranged against me. Against me. And my family. And my family. Reveal all to me, Lord. How much to go? We are not going to pray. We need to pray. My Father and my God, you are a shepherd. Mighty Father, you are a shepherd. Any healing. 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 Secret societies. And most people does not know until the day he died. When the burial, the time of burial, you you will you will know. Some people will hide it, even to their wife, will not know about it. And in such secret, they have secret covenants. And the children will not know what has been happening into their life. We are going to pray that God will reveal every hidden covenant, hidden agreement that are fighting us from our family. When we talk about family, it does not really mean you have only your father's compound. No. You are village. There are some villages, there are trees. Every village has a God that they serve. They will tell you during the war, is this God that saved us? There is no village that does not have it. Go and find out if you don't know. Yes. Every village has what they serve. They say during the war, is the God that saved them. So because of that, they will be serving that God. There are which every so there is a secret, there is a covenant. It means that every child born in that place, whether they're born in abroad, your lineage is from there. If you check your DNA, it's from that village. Praise Master Jesus. 
Because yeah. most people will say because they didn't bomb in the village. Whether they born in America, in Europe, wherever they born you, as long as you are from that village. If you like change your name, you don't change your blood. Praise Master Jesus. We are going to pray. As children of God, the Bible told us, say, God will not do anything until he reveal his secret to his servant. Yes. We are all servants of God. Amen. We are going to pray, oh God, anoint my heart. And not my spiritual heart. I not my spiritual eye. Let me see that hidden covenant. Let me know that hidden covenant. And not my eye, O Lord. And not my eye, Lord. To see, 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 to see. Oh my Father, I know. Jehovah has shown to me. And not my eye. And not my eye. Just to see that hidden covenant. That hidden covenant. Oh, begin to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray. My God, my God, my God. She over the shelf today. As I sleep tonight, as I sleep tonight. Reveal yourself. Reveal yourself. You are God of secret. You are God of secret. Reveal your secret unto me. Reveal your secret unto me. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. We are still going to repeat this prayer. You know, sometimes the Bible says that spiritual things is foolishness unto a canon man. Yes. When you tell some people that God can show you something, they say, How can? That God shows their secrets. Mm -hmm. I thank God for the every testimony in this ministry. Yes. I have told many people, I say, Seek God for three days, seven days. God will show you that secret. Praise Master Jesus. Amen. And then there are testi there are people are testifying testimonies. God. When you pray and say, God, show me this. It can be through dream, through trance. He show it. We are going to pray. That tonight as I sleep, Amen. Lord, let me see any hidden covenant from my father's house. As I sleep tonight, oh God, connect my spirit. Expose all the Apostle John said, he said, I am in the spirit. Yes. And the Lord spoke by thy hand. Yes. yes. Lord, tonight. Lord, tonight. As I sleep, let me be in the spirit. As I sleep, let, let me be in the spirit. Let me see those secrets. Let, let me see those secrets. Hidden covenant. Hidden covenant. Begin to pray, begin oh, to pray, oh, begin to pray. My father and my God. Oh, she oh, over oh, and to me. Kings of kings, kings of glory. My father and my God. As I sleep tonight, as I sleep tonight, as I sleep tonight, my Lord and my God, Jehovah El Shem to me, kings of pickings of glory, as I sleep tonight, oh God, open my eyes, open my eyes, open my eyes, open my eyes, to see no secrets, to see his secrets, to see his secrets, my Father and my God, expose it, oh God. Expose it, oh God. Expose it, oh God. Expose it, oh God. Thank you, Jesus. Open my eyes, oh God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Jesus. Thank you, Kings of Kings. In Jesus' name we pray. Every tree. That my heavenly father did not plant in my life be uprooted. Every tree. Let me just explain what is this tree. Tree is sickness. Every tree your father has not planted in your life. Tree is failure. Tree is fear. This tree is stagnation. This tree is barrenness, unfruitfulness. This tree is disappointment. This tree is disease. This tree is shame. We are going to pray. Every tree that my father has not planted be rooted out. Be rooted out by the power in the name of Jesus. Make it a prayer, begin to pray. My father and my God. Every tree that my father has bought, planted, every day, every day, every fear, today, I will 
Against my life from evil authors in the name of Jesus. I want to explain when we talk about causes from evil authors, there are some people that take people's name, picture, cloth, property. Many times we were at home, sometimes you will see that somebody hand cloth, you will not see it again. After three days, you will see the cloth again. Praise Master Jesus. There is a certain, some people, they will be watching you. As you make a step, the place you march your foot, they will take the sand from that place. There are some people, when they are doing their marriage, they will, as they are doing, they will pin their leg in the ground and pin that marriage so that they will not, they will not be fruitful. There are so many things the enemy is doing. We are going to pray. Wherever they have taken you and them to, Wherever you are taking the name of your family to, wherever you are taking your picture, your property, whatever thing that concerns you, today we are praying, oh God. That's why we take authority. Any cause of any man, any cause of any woman, knowingly or unknowingly, today we pray. We cut it off today in the name of Jesus. Today we take authority over every cause. And we begin to notify it. We begin to notify it with no effects. We will not have any effects. I send it to back to the sender. I send it back to the sender. Any cause of the enemy, any cause of man, any cause of woman, I send it back. I send it back. I send it back. I send it back. Back to the sender. Back to the sender. Back to the sender. My Father and my God, Jehovah has shelter of me. Every devilation, the and the and divination against Jacob, against my life. Today we declare your law. Any causes of my parents will not affect me. Any causes of my family will not affect me. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, we pray. The Bible says that there is no enchantment. The creation again has of the get the house of Jacob. We are going to pray. Every cause in my family today, I break you. No matter the age, no matter the generation, whatever they call cause today, I destroy you. Whatever they call cause today will destroy you. Any cause placed in my family will not affect me. Any cause placed in my family will not affect me. Any cause placed in my family will not affect my children. Any cause placed in my family will not affect me. Any cause placed against my family will not cause anything in my life. Any cause in my family will not affect me. Any cause in my family will not affect my generation. You don't affect my marriage. Today, I take authority and I, I destroy every cause. I notify them. I send it back to where it's coming from. I send it back where it's coming from. I send it back to where it's coming from. And the fire in the name of Jesus. Make it a prayer and begin to pray. My Father and my God. 
No cause will affect my children. It will not harm. It will not cause my children. My father and my daughter. I return it back to the sender. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Every cause of mental, Every cause of mental and, physical sickness and physical sickness be broken in the name of Jesus. I want to explain. There's some family that are mad, that are wrong mad. Praise Master Jesus. That's why you want to marry, you must pray very well. Whether you are a woman, you are going to marry your husband's family, you don't even know them. You don't know the sickness. You don't know the cause later. You are a man. You are going to a family to marry a woman. You don't know the causes. You don't know what is later. All you know, I love her. I love him. Praise Master Jesus. There are families that run mad. Threatening from generation to generation. Every generation there must be a mad man or a mad woman. Check it. There are families like that. They run mad. Mental, sometimes, mental, they can wear suits, they can be clean, but the mental is hot. Mm. It's not everyone that wear rag, and you think only those that wear rag are mad. There are people that don't wear rag, but they are mad. Their mental is hot. Some are physical madness, physical sickness. Is a heritage from the family. It's a cause. Today, every cause of mental and physical sickness be broken by the power in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Father, my Lord and my God, every mental and physical sickness that runs from family to family, from generation to generation, today they are broken. Today they are broken. Today they are broken. Today they are broken. My Lord and my God, every mental and physical sickness running from violence be broken today. Be broken today. Be broken today. Be broken today. My Father and my God, Jehovah Hashem today. Wherever I come from, they are broken in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name. We are going to pray. There's some family that is a cause that is still. Every of their generation they will have a robber or who still. And when you enter such family, you don't know. At the time you see your children, they begin to steal. And you begin to wonder. Your mother does not steal. Your father does not steal. Where does this thing come from? You are just surprised. You don't know where it comes from. It's from family. There are families that are wrong in every generation and they defy one. We are going to pray. Every spirit, every stealing spirit in my family, where I marry, today I stand against you. You are broken by the power of the Make it a prayer, begin to pray. My Father and my God, Jehovah has shown to me every spirit of stealing, every spirit of stealing from my father's heart, from where I am. Today I stand against you. Today I stand against you. You are destroyed. You are destroyed. You are destroyed. Wherever you are operating from, wherever you are operating from, Today you are destroyed. Today you are destroyed. Today you are destroyed. My Father and my God, Jehovah Rapha, the King of the King of Glory, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. 
There is one testimony I had concerning this thing. A very beautiful girl. To marry is a problem. Each time he dates, he steal. Not that she's rich. Her father is rich. The day the Lord delivered her, she said she will have money. She has money. That's not that she's broke. The father is rich. She will enter a supermarket and buy some quality things. But she will steal something that lies just like maybe chewing gum. He, he said that power will just push her to go and steal. She will steal it. And each time she steal, they will catch her and she will start crying. People don't understand. Every relationship she enters, scatter. and when he enters the mass, and he will steal something. Not that it, something she has. He says sometimes when she steal it, she will go out and throw it away. Mm. Praise the master Jesus. Amen. She steal what she do not need. His forces, his power from her father's house, just to destroy her destiny. We are going to pray. Every spirit of stealing running from my family, running from where I married. Today I stand against you. Today you are destroyed. Make it a prayer, make it a prayer, make it a prayer. My father and my God, she over her shelf to me. Every power provoking this stealing, every spirit of stealing, wherever they are, wherever they are coming from, today I stand against them. Today I stand against them. They are destroyed by the power in the name of Jesus. Today they are destroyed. Today they are destroyed. Today they are destroyed. Today they are destroyed. Every spirit of stealing, wherever they are coming from, today they are destroyed. Today they are found. In the name of Jesus, thank you, my Jesus. Thank you, for the of me. Thank you for who you are. There is no one like you. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Any covenant, any covenant, heritage from my parents, that is affecting my life, negatively. Be broken by the power in the name of Jesus. Any covenant, heritage from my parents, that is affecting my life negatively, be broken in the name of Jesus. Let us make it a prayer. Any covenant heritage from my parents that is affecting my life negatively be destroyed today. 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 Any covenant. Any covenant. I hear it from my parents. Destroy today. Destroy today. Destroy today. Destroy today. My Lord and my God. Jehovah Hashem today. Every covenant. Heritage from my parents. Today be destroyed. Today be destroyed. Today be destroyed. By the power in the name of Jesus. Every covenant, O oh God, that I have heritage from my parents. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Mighty Jesus. My Lord and my God. Kings of Kings of Glory. Wherever they are coming from. Today they are destroyed. Today they are destroyed. Today they are destroyed. Mighty Jesus. In Jesus' name. We are going to pray. There are some certain things we hear it from our families. Hot temper. Some people, their father, hot temper. Their mother, hot temper. Or their grandparents, hot temper. And one of their children must take it. Remember the story of uh, Moses. The Bible said that Simeon, he's talking about his generation, Simeon and Levi, he affects this is where Moses come from. And Moses inherited her temper from his background. And this her temper made Moses to kill an Egyptian. And he flew to the land of Midian. When God called him, even God called him, not devil now, God called him. Yet he struck. 
He struck the uh, the stove two times because of annoyance, hot temper. And God said, because of that, you will see the promised land, but you will not enter. Hot temper. It affected him. He inherited it. The Bible says, it says, Simeon and Levi, there is wickedness. Hot temper. Evil. Hot temper. Most of us today, what has destroyed our relationship is hot temper. When this spirit of hot temper will come, you will destroy everything. At the end, you will start regretting. We are going to pray. Every spirit of hot temper. Jesus. Heritage from my family. Wherever I inherited it. Today you are destroyed by the power in the name of Jesus. Amen. You hot temper. Today I take authority. Today I can control myself. Today I take that power from the Holy Ghost. To control my emotion. You will no longer destroy my destiny. You will no longer destroy my relationship. You will no longer destroy my destiny. You hot temper. Today I renounce you. Today I renounce you. You will not take authority over me again. Today he has torn. I take authority now to control my emotion. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Every spirit, every spirit behind all temper, I destroy you today. I destroy you today. I destroy you today. You all temper today. I come against you. 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 I come in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, we pray. We are still going to pray because this hot temper. I'm going to pray that. Whatever this hot temper had made me to lose in the past. Whatever he had destroyed in my life. Whatever he had destroyed in my life. Today, Lord, restore them unto me. Today, Lord, restore them unto me. Make, make it a prayer. Lord, 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 Lord. Whatever he had caused me in the past. Whatever he had caused me in the past. Today, I reclaim it. Today, be restored. Restore my joys. Restore them, O oh God. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Praise the Lord. Any oath strengthens satanic covenant in my destiny. Catch fire. Any oath strengthens satanic covenant in my family, in my destiny, be destroyed. In the, in the name of Jesus. Let me explain. When you take oath, this oath, it makes the powers, it's a commitment. It makes the spirit, the ministering spirit of devil or the agents to be able to carry the function. Because they have taken an oath. So that means they must carry out so those oaths, even, even if when they are weak, when they remember the oath they take, it strengthens them to move, to make sure that covenant, that agreement is being done. So that's why we are going to pray against them. Any oath strengthens satanic covenant in my destiny. Cash fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Make it a prayer, make it a prayer. Father, my Lord and my God, Jehovah has shelter me. 
any oath strengthen satanic covenant in my destiny, in my marriage, in my life. Catch fire! Catch fire! Catch fire! Catch fire! Catch fire! My Lord and my God, Jehovah Esham today, games of pictures of glory. My Lord and my God, any oath threatening satanic covenant in my destiny, catch fire, catch fire, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I release myself. I release myself. Glory. Glory. And favor. And favor. From the captivities of satanic covenant. From the captivity of satanic covenant. I release myself. I release myself. Of glory. Of glory. And honor. And honor. Favor. Favor. From captivity. From captivity. Of satanic covenant. Of satanic covenant. Job begin to pray. I release yourself. Of glory. Of glory. And free from and free. Let my glory come back. Let my favor come back. Let the glory of God come back. Oh, my Father and my God, I release myself. Glory, 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 glory. Favor of God. Mercy of God. Oh, my Father and my God, I release my destiny. I release my destiny. Oh, glory of God. I release it. I release it. Conductivities. The activities of the satanic covenant. Thank you, Jesus. I retrieve it. I retrieve all my glory, all my favor, and the success. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Any altar that is receiving animal blood or human blood to be empowered against me scattered by the Holy Ghost fire any altar that is receiving animal blood or human blood to be empowered against me scattered by the Holy Ghost, the Holy fire, Ghost. in the name of Jesus. Name of what Jesus. are we trying to say? There are altars. They want to threaten that altar. They will kill goats. They will use the blood. Some altar, what they use is human being. Blood is what they use to make sure they empower that altar to fight us. That's why we are praying that God will scatter them. Yes. The Bible told us that when God arrives, the enemy will scatter. He said, It's God that frustrated the devices of the enemies. Today, God will scatter them by the power in the name of Jesus. Any altar receiving animal blood or human blood to be empowered against me, scatter, 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 scatter. My Father and my God, Jehovah has shared to me. Every altar receiving human blood, receiving animal blood, to be strengthened, to be empowered against me. Today is scatter. Today is scatter. Today is scatter. Today is scatter. Scatter by the fire in the name of Jesus. Scatter, scatter, scatter wherever you are, wherever you are, wherever you are. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Any evil power, Any evil power mandated, to my mandated to monitor my progress, my job, my job be, destroyed. be destroyed. Any evil power, Any evil power mandated, mandated to, monitor my progress, to monitor my progress, my joy, my joy be, destroyed. be destroyed in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let me explain. There are monitoring spirits that monitor your progress. Each time you are happy, yes, I am prospering. Each time you have planned a project and saved the money, something will come and collect that money from your hand. When that thing comes, it's something you cannot resist. 
that money must go. There are people that will gather and gather and gather and scatter. It's not their fault. There are powers monitoring your progress. That's why some women that will be pregnant, once is one month, three weeks, three months, miscarriage will come. They monitor and they will see one thing or the other in the dream. Before they know it, they will lose that child. There are monitoring spirits. We are going to pray against them today. Amen. Any evil power, any evil power, mandated, mandated, contracted, contracted to monitor me, to monitor me, my progress, my progress, my joy, my joy, my success, my success. Today go down, today go down, today go down. Today go down. You are destroyed by the power in the name of Jesus. Make it a prayer. Begin to pray. Every monitoring spirit. Every monitory mirror, every monitory mirror, every monitory satellite, wherever you are, today I destroy you by the power in the name of Jesus. Every monitory agent, wherever you are, monitoring my progress, monitoring my marriage, monitoring my children, monitoring my ministry, monitoring my relationship, monitoring my business, today you are destroyed. Today you are destroyed. Today you are destroyed. Today you are destroyed. I take authority by the power in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are, any spirit, monitor spirit, mandate to monitor me. My going out, you will follow me. My coming in, you will follow me. Today you are destroyed. Today I destroy you. You evil covenant. You evil people. Wherever you are, catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire! Catch fire! Be destroyed now! Be destroyed now! Be destroyed now! You fire that eat my body! You fire that take my resources! Today be destroyed! Today be destroyed! Today be destroyed! You spirit of enemy, wherever you are gathered, today be destroyed! Today you be destroyed! In the name of Jesus, we are going to pray. These are the spirits. Of leaking pocket. Mm. You will gather, you will gather and plan. At the end of the day, you will not achieve it. Mm. What they do, they will must bring a hole where once that money, when that money is small, they will not come. Mm. Until that money is big, they will consider that your effort will just go like that. Today we are going to pray. Every evil satellite, wherever they are. Every monitoring spirit, every evil mirror, today break down. Amen. Today break down. Amen. By the power in the name of Jesus. Make it a prayer, make it a prayer. Every spirit of picking pocket, my Father and my God, every evil satellite, every evil mirror, wherever you are, you are destroyed. 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 My father, come down, come down, come down, come down. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, we are going to pray. You spirit that put that ministry. You spirit of Buddha ministries. Wherever you are. Wherever you are. From my father's house. From my father's house. From my mother's house. From my mother's house. From my village. From my village. Today is your end. Today is your end. You power that destroy ministries. You power that destroy ministries. Today you are destroyed by the power in the name of Jesus. The Bible told all that our gift will make room for us. There are powers they know that when you excel. You will make it in life. So what they do, they will fight it. There are families that are, they are from native doctors. They want you to serve their gods. And God is using you and they are fighting you. We are going to pray. God has given us individual ministries. And he said that this gift, this ministry will make room for us. Yes. That we will not stand before men, men but we stand before kings yes. and presidents. And there is a power fighting us to 
will meet us. Today we are praying. Every power that brings that ministry catch fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Open your mouth and begin to pray. My Father and my Lord, you have shepherd me. You have given me ministry, O oh God. Every power fighting my ministry. Every power fighting my ministry. Today I come down. Today I Today I will down. Every power fighting my ministry. Every power fighting my ministry. From my father's side. From my mother's side. From my vision. From Salamanca. From Spain. Today I come against you. Today I come against you. I put you down today. 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 In the name of Jesus. Thank you, in Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name. Whatever evil agreement made or entered by my ancestors on behalf of the generations is thereby notified. I cancel them. I make them no effect by the blood of Jesus. Whatever evil agreement made or entered with my sisters, on, be on behalf of our generation, is thereby cancelled. Not the fire. Made no effect. Made no effect. Powerless. Make it a prayer. Begin to pray, my Father and my God. Every evil agreement made or entered by my sister on behalf of that generation is thereby cancelled, is thereby notified. No effect. Powerless. I declare them 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 powerless. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Any evil covenant. Any evil covenant. Attracting problems. Shame. And disgrace. To my glory. Be consumed by fire. Any evil covenant. Attracting problems. Shame. And disgrace. To my glory. Be consumed by fire. Make it a prayer. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Any covenant attracting problems. Shame. Disgrace. To my glory, be consumed today. 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 My Father and my God, Jehovah and Shem today, came to pick of glory. Any evil governor, attracting problems, shame, and disgrace. To my glory, be consumed by fire. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Whatever gener generational causes. Whatever generational causes. Evil covenant, evil covenant and manipulations, and manipulations of, evil family, of evil family alter, alter be generated, generated that have been generated in the past. That have been generated in the past. My merciful father, my merciful father taught them to blessings. And testimonies. And testimonies. Today, in the name of Jesus. Whatever generational causes, evil covenant, and manipulations of evil family altar may have generated in the past, my my merciful father, turn them to blessings and testimonies. Today, in 
the name of Jesus. I want you to pray. I want you to begin to pray. Whatever generational causes, generational covenants, their manipulations, whatever it has caused you, whatever damages, whatever problem it has, whatever disappointment, my Father and my God, turn it into blessing. Turn it into blessing. Turn it into blessing. Turn it into testimonies. Turn it into testimonies. My blessing to God. My Father and my God. Every struggle will God cost me. Whatever pain that has cost me. Turn it to God. Thank you, mighty Jesus. In Jesus' name. We are going to pray. Whatever pain, whatever damage, whatever disgrace, whatever loss that generational causes are cost us, evil covenant. Their manipulation. My Father, my God. Turn those pain to blessings, to honor and testimonies, to joy. Open your mouth and begin to pray. My Father and my God, Jehovah Esheh today, whatever they have cost me, every pain, every shame, every disgrace. Every trouble, my Father and my God, turn it to my blessings. Turn it to my blessings. Turn it to my honor. Turn it to my faith. Turn it to my joy. Turn it to my glory. Whatever they have cost me, turn it to my glory, Lord. Now I want you to pray to God concerning your heart desire. There is something you are believing God for this year. You are in the month of September. Maybe most of you are not in say God. The year is almost, always, almost gone. Can he come to pass again? The Bible told all that a day is like a thousand years. The eyes of God. And thousand years is like a day. You are serving the God of divinity. God of miracle. God will still do it. Why not begin to come into God's hand? The Bible said our as our faces are different, so our hearts is like this. It says we are serving a mighty God that opened his thing up to satisfy every desire of every liberty. What is that project in your mind? What is that dream in your mind? What is that plan in your mind? What is that your heart desire? What is that thing you want to do this year? What is that thing you want to do? My Father and my God, Jehovah and shelter me. Is it a concerning finance? Is it healing? Is it your health? Is it your relationship? Is it your marriage? Is it about children? Is it about job? Is it about resident family? What is that thing that you are committing to God? Committing to God today. God will do it, he will do it, he will do it. He never fail. You are serving the God of last week. He will rise, he will do it for you. We are serving the God of nine hours sleep or slumber. Our God, oh God, mighty God. Let do it for us. Our God, oh God, mighty Jesus. Let us, oh God, in the end of our endeavors. Let your will be done, oh God. Do it and take all that glory. 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 Thank you, our Father, our God. Thank you, mighty Jesus. There is no one like you, Lord. Our Father, our God, we thank you. Kings of kings, we thank you. 
I just want you to thank God. Say, my father, my father, I thank you for delivering me. I thank you for delivering me and giving me everlasting victory. And giving me everlasting against my enemies. Don't begin to thank God. Thank you for delivering me today. Thank you for giving me victory. Thank you for the victory. Thank you for the victory. Thank you for the victory. Thank you, our Father, our God. You shall not be right. Thank you for what I have done. Thank you for giving me victory today. Thank you, Lord God, for giving me testimony. Thank you, Thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for everything you have done in our life, oh Lord. Thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Father, we thank you. Thank you Jesus. We thank you for the grace and victory you are giving us. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for breaking these family altars and all these family evil covenant. Amen. Thank you for giving us this empowerment today. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for fighting this battle for us. Because this battle, we cannot fight it. Thank you because we know we are coming with testimony. Amen. Thank you, O oh God, because we know you are giving us victory. Amen. Thank you, our Father, our God. Thank you, Jesus. Our life will never remain the same. Amen. We shall experience your hand in our life. Amen. Thank you for touching us. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for the gift and ministry you are giving us. Amen. We shall excel. Amen. Never before. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The world will hear our ministry. Amen. And our ministry will pull people out from the kingdom of darkness Amen. into the kingdom of light. We will not die prematurely. But we will live to declare the wonderful work of the Lord. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We will not bury our children. Amen. Because the Bible says our old age, our children will be at the gate to defend us. Amen. We soak and cover our life with the blood of Jesus. Lord of Jesus. We soak and call our ministry with the blood of Jesus. Lord of Jesus. Thank you for this privilege you are giving us today. Thank you, mighty Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let's say be your name. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. The grace. And the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Lord of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit, rest and abide with us now and forever. Amen. Surely, Amen. goodness and mercy shall follow us. All the days of our life, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen.